Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. I would like to share with you discrete annualized return using Google Spreadsheets. Here we have the investment amount, uh, $100, and a return of $130 after two years. And to calculate that, in terms of its discrete annualized return, the formula is the return divided by the investment amount to the law uh, to the exponent one over the number of years in this case is two uh, in this case it's also e2 minus one and that will give us the percentage for that discrete annualized return in this case 14 percent would be our discrete annualized return now what i've done with the rest is i've set up uh, a random between. So in this case, random between zero to 1,000. So if I invest $100, I can make zero to one uh, zero to $1,000. I don't know the future, so I'm 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 guessing, and it's just a guess. It's not an accurate one, obviously. So I use rand between, and in this case, it's 179. The number of years is one minus one. And here is our calculation. And it tells me that I will make 79% if I may have an investment of 100 and I make $179. Now, <clears throat> I've used the RAND between, so these numbers are going to change. Watch. Put an A in here. And all those numbers have now changed. And you can see that my discrete annualized return changes. Now, let's play with these numbers a bit. I'm not going to make a 1,000. Uh, it's just wishful, wishful thinking that I'm going to make so much. So I'm going to keep it reasonable or less romanticized. And I'll say that my investment fund has never made more than 25%. So... 25% would be 125. And now let's copy that and then populate it down. So <clears throat> my return could be anywhere between zero to $125. Now, Randomly, you see that I get a lot of numbers under that. And you also see that, at least in this instance, if I, if I only make $17 return on my $100 investment, I have effectively, I'm negative 83%. I don't get any return. Well, okay, I get a very small return. Because in fact, this is how much I have at the end of the year. So I need to bump this up so that it's at minimum 100. That makes more sense, sorry. Let's copy that. And now let's paste it down. Now, there we go. So my, my investment is $100. If I make $1, my investment after one year, it would be a 1% return, discrete annualized return. If I invest $100 and my return is $118 in two years, then my return is 8%. If I invest $100 and my return is $122 over three years, my rate, my discrete annualized return is 6% and etc cetera, etc cetera. so this formula here can be very useful in in helping you get a rough idea as to what kind of numbers you can expect keep in mind this is a random number but as the future is very hard to detect being able to uh, visualize some of these potential outcomes is useful to say the least. Thank you for your time and happy computing.